Hey friends, how are you? I know it's been a little while since I've been on here. I've been so busy and I've been doing some really awesome things. Um, as a coach, uh, I have found some really great opportunities to learn from other coaches recently. And huge shout out to Mama Fox. Um, I post a lot of her stuff here on my page and she has held a coaches coaching session where we're learning how to coach um, stubborn losers. A uh, stubborn loser is somebody who loses less than a pound every couple of weeks, somebody who loses maybe a pound a month or four pounds a year, um, somebody who just is really stuck. Um, and this time in our lives, this over 40, over 50, when our hormones slow down and things are just different, um, that can happen super easily. And I'm there. Um, I don't have a lot of weight to lose, but I had about six to eight pounds I want to lose, and I've lost four pounds already. Woohoo! Giving up a praise offering. Anyway, um, I hinted earlier that uh, I'm going to be starting a coaching group soon, and I wonder if you would like to do it now before Christmas, or maybe wait until after Christmas and the holidays. Um, but I would like to uh, run a Stubborn Losers group myself. I have loved this menu. It is a menu that's on the Trim Healthy Mama website. Um, and I've learned so many awesome things about th like things that are available on the website, things that I just never even knew about. Um, so uh, I am so excited to share it with you guys. But I'll tell you, I got some stuff going on. Y'all, I'm drinking a salad today. This is called the earth milk sip it's on page 402 of the cookbook y'all this has got a cup of salad in it i know it sounds weird but i have a client who is a true celiac and she is dealing with some other health issues at the moment and it, we have to really look for um just some alternatives for her. She really needs some help right now with reducing inflammation. And she does well. She's a bariatric patient as well. And so she does well like I do with baby greens. I don't handle um, things like full-size leaf lettuces or um, larger heads of cabbage. Um, I do really well with like uh, baby field greens or baby spinach, the larger leaves of spinach kind of, I don't know, they just kind of sit, they don't digest as easily in my bariatric tummy. And so this calls for a cup of baby field greens. And I just had an organic box, you know, about this big, just a, enough for like two salads of some organic baby uh, mixed greens. And so I tossed that in here with some uh, protein powder, MCT, some sweetener. I used some green matcha tea rather than the oolong tea because I've already had an oolong tea drink today. So uh, it has gelatin, um, cinnamon, sunflower lecithin, some sweetener. I'll tell you what, this is like drinking a thin milkshake. This is so filling and so delicious. If you have the cookbook or you are on the Trim Healthy Mama membership, get this. It is the Earth Milk Sip. Super simple, super delicious, a great way to add greens to your day, to be filled, to add other nutrition like the sunflower lecithin. Um, cinnamon is a superfood. Uh, the whey helps you feel full. As a matter of fact, I'm counting this toward the protein in my lunch today. Um, so anyway, this thing is amazing. Also, did you get the new e -Zine? Have you signed up for the Trim Healthy Mama uh, emails, the weekly emails? You can do that on TrimHealthyMama.com. Get methylating soup. Okay. I printed this out. It talks about why methylation is so important and the best way to help your body um, it detox. The best way possible is to use 
ingredients, like real ingredients, not vitamins, not supplements that you're going to buy from a company, real food. And one of the highest foods to help you methylate, it's the highest in folic acid or folate, and that is lentils. I've never had lentils. I don't know if I like them or not. Uh, but if you make this and then you throw in a big bunch of spinach, you have eaten, it's an E, see, it's an E, and so you've had a great E meal and you have eaten your entire day's worth of folate, rich vitamin B, to help your body detox from all the junk that we put in it and all the junk that's just in the air and medicines and pills and whatever we take, even something as simple as um, my allergy medicine, you know? I mean, this stuff just gets in your system. It's awful. This with spinach in it is going to give you all that you need for one day. So tomorrow we're methylating. I am making me some soup. And you know what? I watched the video on it and uh, that's on the website as well. And I can't wait to make this. I'll let you know how it goes. Also got a couple of new recipes. And let me show you what I do. This is my Stubborn Losers cookbook. And I just wrote THM Stubborn Losers menu. And what I've done is, let me find where we started really quickly here. I'm sorry. Okay, our very first menu is back here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It was the veggie full menu. Okay, so here I have my tab and I put veggie full menu and I went in and I printed my menu. And here's the back. I printed my grocery list. With each one of these menus, there's a grocery list. I went through and found the things that I already have in my cabinet and I crossed them off. I read the notes. There are notes from Pearl in here. On every single one of the menus, there are notes from Pearl. These things are gems of information. So I read her notes. I did all the things that she said to do. And you know what? I didn't die that week. I say that to my kids all the time. They're like, Mom. And I'm like, did you die? No, you didn't. So I didn't die that week. I ate sweet potatoes. I ate avocados. Guess what? I didn't die. I don't love them, but they give you a couple of different ways in here to try them. A couple of different things to do to add them to your foods. A couple of things that you can hide in your foods so that your husband or your picky kids don't see it. Different ways to add more veggies to your day. It was amazing. Anyway, I would really love to do this with you. I don't have the details yet because God's really just been speaking to me. And I just feel like he wants me to jump in. So I hope that you've watched this video. I hope that you kind of start to get excited too, that you start looking at this going, that sounds good. I think I'm a stubborn loser. Now, I will put the caveat in. I don't want you to do this if you're brand new to Trim Healthy Mama, okay? Trim Healthy Mama is grace. It's food freedom. It's learning to love how to eat. But if you're an over 50 mama and you just want a group to do something with and you want some encouragement and you want prayer, give me a buzz. Let me know. So once I get this figured out here in the next few days, although I've got company coming, uh, we have a huge competition this weekend and we have some company coming. So it might not be this week, but as soon as I get this figured out, I'll post it and we will get a group started. But please, please, please let me know. Would you want to wait until after Christmas or do you want to jump in and lose some weight before Christmas comes? Let me know how you feel. Remember, we need food to live. That's why I'm here. I've learned how to use the food that God gives me to thrive, not to sit at home and feel sorry for myself anymore. 
And I want you to do that too. I want you to have that freedom. And that's why I love THM. And that's why I love being a Trim Healthy Mama coach. So let me know your thoughts. Remember what I said. We need food to live, but we need Jesus for our life. Thanks for watching. Bye.